The next topic that I want to talk about here is going to be outside of the Google Workspace Admin Console. This is about Tricent. Tricent is a web application that helps you unshare any Google Drive files that are shared with third parties or external users. That is either an existing shared file before you deploy the tool or anything that is shared after the deployment. So you're actually covered in terms of historical activities or previously shared files and these will be processed whenever you install and deploy the tool to your domain and also you will be setting rules to protect from the future as well. Now the unique thing about this is that it does involve the end users in the unsharing process while allowing the admin to configure the unsharing settings and basically putting your end users responsible for their files and their decision and basically still giving you the end call and the final call on the unsharing of the files and when to unshare these files whenever you want to. Basically it does send email reminders such as this one to your end users and if you scroll in this reminder you will see it's telling me that I have 10 files in my Google Drive and these will be shared by a specific date. This is a previous email that I have got and you see the file list here and there is a button that I click and whenever I click this button it takes me to this page where now I can you know select the files that I want and either unshare them Basically, I can select all and unshare all or just select specific files and unshare them. Or I can just extend the sharing to either 30 days or 90 days or 180 days. Or basically, I can do it to a specific date and then that action will be saved. And basically, that's it. From the perspective of the end user, this is all what they are required to do. They just review the files, they click a button and that's it. They forget about these files. Of course, if they don't take action, as mentioned in the email here, then these files are going to be unshared when the specific date is approached and no action taken, then these files will be unshared. Now, this tool does not require a specific Google Workspace edition. Basically, it will work with any Google Workspace, whether it's the business starter or business standard or plus or even the enterprises and it will just need access to the Google Drive API and that's why you will be able to easily get an overview on all of the externally shared files in your organization which actually would be tricky without this tool if you are on a lower edition of Google Workspace such as the business starter where you don't even get access to the drive audit logs not to mention the investigation tool which is only available in the enterprise editions. Now, in my opinion, if you combine this with the enterprise editions and the enterprise features of Google Workspace, then you will end up with a great solution and a very solid one that will make sure that you are both compliant and protected in terms of shared files and the externally shared files, exposures and the leaks and all of this. Now, also because you will be involving the end users on this, then you as an admin will get some sort of a helping hand. You just configure the settings and policies for the default sharing duration. And then it's up to the users to choose how to appropriately handle the files and what is the appropriate action they would take on each file whenever they receive the alert. And more importantly, this will also let you know at any point in time that you have control over the exposure and the external sharing of the files which does support you when you want to demonstrate your compliance and accountability which can be through showing the settings of the tool and then showing and generating the reports and the audit logs that are available in the dashboard of this tool as well. And also if you want to initiate a domain-wide cleanup, for example, you can simply go to the dashboard, which is something I will be showing you in the next video. This is a very interesting dashboard that contains some statistics and some insights. So if you go to the dashboard and if you go to the administrative actions, you go to bulk cleanup and you will just select the user that you would like to clean up. So for example, I'm selecting this user and with a click of a button, you can unshare all of this user's externally shared files. 
and then you can make sure that this user does not have any externally shared files or any files that are exposed to the outside without the user's knowledge or without any need for them as well. So in the next video, I'm going to dive a little bit deeper into this dashboard. I will be showing you the various controls and the various information that you get from and also something very interesting, which is the statistics report that is very useful and a very nice feature of this tool that you would spend a lot of time and effort generating if you're doing it through GAM or any other tool actually. So that's something for the next video.